What's up guys? This is Oof for Days and this is going to be the 10th script showcase episode and it's going to be on Dark Hub, a new free script hub. Well, I guess it's not that new. It's been out for a little while, but I haven't gotten to showcase it yet. So this is my showcase for Dark Hub. So to get Dark Hub, you're going to want to go to my website, oofferdays.weebly.com and you can go to the scripts tab. And as you can see, there will be a thing called Dark Hub free and a little bit of a post that I made about it. And then if you click right here, I'm going to use a VPN just in case the owner of the script hub pulls IPs off of his website or his script or whatever. So I would recommend a VPN if you use the script just in case like they pull IPs and they do stuff with it. You never know. Click on that. And then go ahead and copy this load string. You might have to control C it. Yeah, you, put, yeah, you have to control C it. And then you get your exploit, paste it. This script hub works with a majority of the paid exploits. I think they have a list of supported exploits somewhere. I'm not 100% sure where it's at. Let me see if I can get it. They also have a Discord server, so you can join their Discord. So I think this is... I'm trying to find the list of supported exploits. Well, it supports a lot of different exploits. So... Uh, I th I'm pretty sure it supports Synapse, Sentinel, Proto Smasher, and Surhurt, and maybe Calamari. I don't know though. I don't think Calamari works because you know it bans on injection on Strucid. So the first game, of course, that we're going to be showing you guys with Dark Hub is Strucid, since that is my probably most demanding game in terms of scripts. And this account is banned because Dark Hub sucks, and I tr tested it earlier and got banned. So we make a new account. Uh, quick note, if you get banned from Strucid or any other game for using Dark Hub, I'm not responsible. I didn't make it, so I, there's nothing I can do about Dark Hub bans. My only suggestion to you is not to cheat on your main with Dark Hub, as it is. There is a pretty good chance that you might get banned on, like, Strucid, maybe Arsenal as well. I'm gonna be showing you guys a couple games with this hub. Also, a new script showcase for Fucker Hub is going to be coming soon, as there's a lot of new features added to it. In Fucker Hub Mega Update 2, there will be a new script showcase for it. So that'll probably be a couple episodes. Let's go ahead and join a game of Strucid. Okay, go ahead and execute. You'll see a little GUI that's going to pop up here on the left. You're going to hit start. And it boots, as you can see. So they have, they have a couple mods. They have some aimbot and aimbot mods here. They do have a no fall in god mode, so we'll try those out. And we're also going to use their silent aim. And also their ESP. I, it seems, it, look, it looks like it looks pretty nice, but I'm going to change the en enemy color because I don't like it. They also have skeleton ESP, which is kind of cool, I guess. And we are going to just use those. And the gun mods have a ban risk, so I wouldn't recommend using these, but I'm going to use them anyways to see if I get banned. And to hide this GUI... Oh, wow. That was fast. Okay, so don't use um, gun mods on Dark Hub on Shrucid. It is detected. I don't know if I left the game fast enough. Okay, I'll F4 fast enough. So yeah, definitely uh, don't use gun mods. I won't use gun mods because I guess they're detected. This is what happens when you use free GUIs, guys. This is why you should buy a fucker hub. Alright, so to hide this GUI, it's right control. Wow, what the hell? Is there no wall bang? Oh yes, there is. There we go. It's pretty trash. You need gun mods to make this game really worth cheating on. So let's see if I can try the gun mods again. Uh, we only really need no spread. Really just no spread, then you just hit every shot. So you don't really need any other gun mods besides that. Maybe uh, infinite ammo. Yeah, this is fine. I don't know, maybe, the ref maybe they work now? Now that I waited a minute? Oh yeah, there we go. Now it's working, I'm not getting banned. It is kind of laggy though, I'll g I will give you that. This, this script hub is pretty laggy when you use the Strucid script.
Also, for each game, I'm going to be giving each game a rating. Kind of like what I did for Wally's Hub. One thing I did notice is that they don't have an anti-cheat bypass because the word I is spaced out, but spaced out between N and F. Because Struzit has a check to make sure that your ammo bar, which is where, your, where it displays your ammo, and make sure the word inf, inf isn't there. So they definitely don't have like a, a full bypass for this game because they have a space between the I and the N on inf. So I thought that was a little hilarious. Let's try this on another mode, because it's pretty laggy on here. Let's try Zone Wars, see if it works. So far, I would rate Dark Cub maybe a 6 out of 10, because I did get banned. I almost got banned, but since I know how to leave the game and not get banned, it, I was able to get around it. Does Dark Hub not load on here? Okay, yeah, that's pretty trash. So I guess Dark Hub doesn't work on Battle Royale or Zone Wars, which is sad. So yeah, I wouldn't totally recommend this GUI for Strucid. I would not recommend this GUI at all for Strucid. So yeah, because it only works on normal Strucid, I have to give it an even lower score. My final score for Strucid is 4 out of 10. I'm sorry, 4 out of 10. Lots of features, but a lot of them are either detected or just don't work. And my other problem with this hub is that it doesn't work on Battle Royale and Zone Wars, and that's actually pretty important for Strucid. So, yeah, I have to give Dark Hub Strucid a 4 out of 10. If you want a better experience using Strucid scripts, you should buy Fucker Hub or maybe uh, a different paid hub. I would definitely not recommend Dark Hub for Strucid. As there, there's a pretty high ban risk. Like you saw, I just got banned almost instantly when I first used it. So you got to be careful. I'm going to try Phantom Forces next to see if I have any, any luck with this game. Start. See if this has a Phantom Forces script. It does. Alrighty. So let's see if this one works. Uh, uh, no silent. There, there's no silent aim. Aw, that sucks. But it does have jump power. And walk speed mod, so I guess that's kind of cool. Can I change the text box by doing this? No, I can't. Their walk speed might be faster than Wally's, so I guess they I guess they have that. And they also have a fire rate speed. Let's let's turn this all the way up and see what happens. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna keep Flow Bright off. Okay, so right control hides the GUI, and at least they have a no fall damage, so at least the script is kind of okay. But, yeah, no silent name. Yeah, this is, yeah, I'm getting lag back as well. That, that guy's still not dead? What the hell? As you can see, I'm already I'm already out of ammo, and I got wrecked. Okay, so Phantom Forces script so far it's also extremely laggy. As you can see, I'm getting like 40 FPS on a pretty decent computer. So another script I wouldn't recommend for what for this game. I don't know why people say this hub is good. It's really not, but I am showcasing it because it's really the only hub around that's free. And I want to show you guys an alternative to a paid hub. And just show you what it looks like to use shitty free scripts. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm just too spoiled. I think I'm just too spoiled. I'm too used to using rent f f paid scripts. I need to lower the walk speed. This sway is making me sick. Hold on. How much? I'm gonna lower the walk speed. It's making me sick. Okay, this is better. 
Okay, this is a lot better. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Gotta love that. Alright. We're back in action. So there's no silent aim or no like wall bang for this game. And I know I know Phantom most Phantom Force scripts don't have wall bang, but some have a silent aim, so I'm a little bit disappointed about that. But again, this isn't a paid script, so I'm trying not to care in this script too hard because Honestly, I can be extremely nitpicky and explain all the terrible things about this hub. But I'm not going to because it's a free script and I mean, yeah, again, it's a free script. What the fuck are you going to expect out of a free script? You're going to expect a shitty experience and it's it, it's it's just not the same as using paid scripts, guys. I mean, at least this hub has a Phantom Forces script. I guess. Fuck Grub doesn't even have a Phantom Forces script yet. I am working on one though, so expect to see Phantom Forces maybe in, in the Fuck Grub Mega Update 2. I've officially announced Mega Update 2. I don't know when I'm going to start working on that update, but hopefully soon. Probably on Christmas break. Not gonna lie, I might change the the fire interval. Yeah, this is pretty good. But yeah, I don't love it. Alright, that's all I'm gonna do for this game because it's not a great experience at all. Jailbreak time. Let's find out how garbage this is. Also, I apologize if you can't hear sounds like my game sounds. Some some people play copyrighted music in these games. And I'm not trying to get uh, a copyright strike on my channel, so I'm not taking those risks anymore. What the fuck? Wow, my game is... Wow. Okay. Let's try it out. Let's see if they have a jailbreak script and see if it's good. Maybe maybe they'll surprise me with jailbreak. But so far, Struce's script, 4 out of 10. Phantom Forces script, holy shit, 5 out of 10. Uh, this actually looks more promising. This has a fuck ton of features. So, let's see. It's got like a auto- wait, is this an auto farm? A rest farm? Wow, okay. Well, I don't know how old this GUI is, so we'll see how good these features are. Let's try a teleport. Let's go to the 1 million shop and see if it works. Wow, okay. I see they use a car method to get around the TP check. Server. Disrupt ev or destroy everyone's ears. Erupt volcano. Explode wall. Does that actually work? Does open all doors work? I don't think it does, but maybe. Let's see. Does it really work? I don't know if people can see that. But let's try the auto farm. Oh, it works. Okay, at least the auto farm works. Let's see if it actually works. Yeah, it works.
Yeah, okay. This is cool. Alright, well, I will give this script a better rating than the others. I gotta give this one an 8 out of 10. This is a pretty good script. Actually, I take that back. I'll give it a 10. This has a lot of features. I think with all the features it has, and the ones I tested actually working, I think this is a good feature, a good script. My only problem with this would be is that if this script has a big ban risk, like if you can get put in the cage real easily, then I would have a problem with this script and I would lower the rating. But other than it having a possible ban risk, I would definitely give this one a 10 out of 10. And they also have support for a million other games. I think there's like uh, Bloxburg and Arsenal in here as well that I'm not going to showcase. But those are the three games that I decided to showcase for this video as, it, as those are the games I usually showcase for script hubs. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one. Peace out.